Aha! The topic for this video is how to be a tantric lover. This one will be more for men, and uh, it's not. I'm not going to cover the whole thing right now, but I just want to give you a couple of hints because I'm in the process of maybe creating a, an in-depth program about that very soon, and um, I want to tell you a little bit what this is about. You know, this is some of the stuff I've been writing. This is. Uh, the base for what I was teaching at Burning Man, the vital sex techniques, Kamayama, sexual mastery. And I have this one that uh, is a little bit older, but with tons of techniques and practices. All that is on my website at vitalcoaching.com. And then this is the project, the la latest project that I've been working on. is like 200 pages of mantras and codes and energy codes that are not just related with sex, but with a whole lot of <laughs> range of, um, you know, mind codes that we're trying to download in our consciousness as a human race. So there is a lot of you know, a lot of juice and a lot of um, content there that is ready to be downloaded and manifested. And I know that by talking with friends and clients and people around the world that, uh, you know, everybody wants to have a great sex life. And uh, what's, um, you know, what's, uh, what's interesting is that um, the resources and the tools are not readily, readily available. You know, when it comes to sexual education, we are talking about sexuality, we are talking about you know, the anatomies, and uh, it's, it's not really that juicy and that interesting. It's interesting to know about it, and it's important, but what we want is really to understand the, the energetics of sex, the vital sex aspect. You know, how do you have energy sex with somebody? How do you connect? How do you really create connection? And do you have a full um, energetic mastery over your sexual body? So there are so many different aspects, but that's the core, that's the intention when it comes to practical things, you know, how to engage with your lover in a tantric way. We are talking about conscious touch, we are talking about presence, meditation practices, bringing in sacred space, bringing in polarized sessions where you are the giver, the other person is the receiver, or the other way around, um, you know, lots of, lots of things along, along that line, using using massage oils, using um, uh, creating a secret space and um, a whole lot of things that, that are there in, uh, in this uh, sphere of uh, tantric sex. And so my intention or what, what I wish was really present on this planet is that all of that would be mainstream. It's just common knowledge. You wake up in the morning, you are a teenager, you can, you can access this knowledge, you can go for it because it's part of what you're supposed to be learning as a, as a human being to expand and grow. And um, I would say that right now on the planetary level, uh, we don't score very high when it comes to, you know, sexual optimization. We might have some skills, we might have something like that, but there is lots of disturbance in the overall field of sexual energy. You know, there's lots of trauma, there's lots of misunderstandings, there's lots of conflicts and fights, and there's lots of uh, abuse as well going on in there. There's lots of porn, there's lots of addiction. So, you know, it's like we score maybe at 20%. We would like to raise the bar as a human race so that we can really enjoy, remove the guilt and the shame, be comfortable with nakedness and, and just come back to a place of innocence, joy, beauty and love for each other. And, you know, the sharing of, of sexual energy and engaging with, with a partner, with a lover in, in a beautiful play and sensual connection and, and orgasmic bliss, all these things. Wow! We want it, right? Say yes. <laughs> no, seriously, I mean, it's, uh, it's, there is a big gap on the planetary level about that. And uh, I, uh, I hope that we keep on raising the vibration, raising the frequency as human race and start tapping a little bit more in that. Something I mentioned earlier, you know, the idea of, uh, of energy sex, you know, it's so freaking powerful. The idea that you can start engaging with somebody in a flow of energy that is where two energy bodies start to play. And there is sometimes not even, not even touch. Imagine that you're in front of somebody and enter into an orgasmic trance without physical touch. You know, you might be breathing together, you might be moving energies, and then suddenly you feel like there is this raising of Kundalini energy in your system, and you enter into a trance, bliss, together. And then maybe there is a little bit of touch or a little bit of breathing together. There might be something that becomes more erotic, more passionate, even if you go into friction, into the, the traditional form of sex. But the point is that there is a lot right there. 
that we are not yet tapping into and my wish is for you to be really happy as a sexual being. So let's expand on that, see what comes up. I will do my part, keep on posting and creating and, and see if that's something that can contribute into your own evolution and the evolution of, of the planet and humankind along this line of um, vital sex and sexual uh, liberation of our beautiful energies, resource of fire and beauty that is inside of us. I see you soon.